pessimistic. Today's scripture and insight, Genesis chapter 43 verses 10 to 14. If we had not delayed, we could have come back twice by now. Then their father Israel said to them, If it must be so, then do this. Put some of the best products of the land in your packs and take them down to the man as a gift. A little balsam and a little honey, aromatic gum and resin, pistachios and almonds. Take twice as much silver with you. Return the silver that was returned to you in the top of your bags. Perhaps it was a mistake. Take your brother also, and go back at once to the man. May God Almighty cause the man to be merciful to you so that he will release your other brother and Benjamin to you. As for me, if I am deprived of my sons, then I am deprived. Jacob reluctantly agreed to send his sons, Benjamin in tow, back to Egypt. He suggested that they take valuable local gifts, a little balsam and a little honey, aromatic gum and resin, pistachios and almonds, 43 to 11, to curry favor with Egypt's demanding leader. He also sent twice as much silver as before, 43 to 12, thus replacing the returned silver that Joseph could have claimed was stolen and providing money for more grain. But even though he sent them out with a prayer and a blessing, Jacob was patently pessimistic. He assumed that Benjamin would die, 43 to 14. Please. Like, share, subscribe.